Over the past few weeks, we've been getting some teases for season 6, and we now even have some news revolving around the upcoming special, which we've been referring to as the end of Ladybug. So in today's video, we are going to be going over everything, starting off with the new animation studio on board for season 6. Going into the new season, we can look forward to a brand new animation style and assets as teased by Jeremy Zag himself, and we've just gotten some new photos of Dwarf Animation Studio working on season 6. Six. Now, you might be wondering, Maya, why is this exciting? And the reason is because this exact animation studio also worked on the Ladybug and Cat Noir movie, so you can just imagine how different but beautiful this season is going to be. Next is a tweet that Thomas shared where he went to say that he was working on a storyboard, and in it we can see who appears to be a girl with a ponytail and glasses. This could possibly be a new character since not only can we usually expect new characters, characters in new seasons, but also because a while ago he did also reveal that we could expect to meet two more characters with disabilities next season. Going into season 6, we also know that Marinette is going to have a new look, so this could even just be a character we're already familiar with, just with a new style. Also, how cute is it that there was actually a ladybug on the screen? Next, let's discuss what we know about the upcoming special, currently expected to release on August 31st of this year. As some of you may have seen, there has been discussion revolving around the future special, however there was no official source to follow up on anything that was being discussed, but thankfully, brand ambassador Angry Negrest on Instagram has clarified everything that she currently could for us. The first thing Angry Negrest confirmed was that the official title will not be The End of Ladybug, but that she'll share the official one with us when she's able to. This special, like the previous one, is also considered a miraculous world special, and the most exciting thing yet is that that this special will be taking place during season 5, which she adds that it'll make sense eventually. And last but not least, we have more tweets from Thomas, however, this isn't necessarily news, but I know I got excited after reading this, so here's what he had to say. After somebody tweeted about the PV version of Miraculous Ladybug and how this is what they wanted, Thomas replied by saying, Ask Toei, Media Wan, and Zag. Popular demand can make wonders. He continued responding throughout the thread and said, For years, I've been pushing inside the company to produce some spin-offs, comic books, and so on, but nothing moves for some inexplicable reasons. Maybe it's a French thing, we're not accustomed to extended universes. My position is only creative, I have no power to greenlight any project myself, but maybe popular, friendly, pressure could work. I already wrote a spin-off bible for a Lady Dragon series, a special episode set in Brazil, a spin-off bible for a show set in Brazil, as well, we wrote how the world from Shadybug works. I got stories about how Majestia and Night Owl met, stories about ancestors, and so on. Also, just as I'm editing this video, Thomas replied to a tweet of a fan asking for a special following Natalie, Gabriel, and Emily during their time exploring for the miraculous, to which Thomas responded to by saying, that too is already written. He also revealed that he wants for the next special to be dedicated to Kagami and in Japan. You guys, how exciting is that? Obviously, this doesn't confirm that we can expect to see any of this in the future, but I like to be optimistic, and I think it would be incredible for the miraculous verse to be so expanded, whether that happens through animation, the series, movies, comic books, novels. I for one know I would love to get a spin-off about Shadybug's world, Lady Dragon, and especially previous Ladybug and Black Cat miraculous holders. Out of everything he mentioned though, what made you the most intrigued? Fingers crossed that one day we could expect to at least see one of the things that he mentioned, but in the meantime, let me know your thoughts and theories down below on all of this exciting news and subscribe so you never miss the tea on the show you love. And an extra special thanks to my Guardian channel members Libby, William, and Amandine for your support and I'll see you all in the next one.